forget where you're coming from. King Shanga set the chain. Yo, I want to them. Mama tell them this. Hey, drop. On a better have some respect and manners. See the Asian them and give them them honors. Respect and manners. Yes. Nothing wrong with that. They always say. Two little simple things can carry you through the world. Respect and manners. That's all I'm asking from you. Respect and manners. Then love will come to you. Respect and manners. That's all I'm asking from you. Respect and manners. And I know you will see you through. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and welcome back to Vlogmas. Now guys, today's video is about five places to visit in the parish of St. Mary. Now, a few days ago I did a video on five places to visit in Ocherias, which is in the parish of St. Anne. But guys, I live in St. Mary, right? St. Mary is a beautiful parish. How could I leave out things to do in St. Mary? So this video is dedicated to five places to visit in the parish of St. Mary. Guys, I've put an extra two at the end of this video, two recommendations for places that I've not actually been to, but I've heard great things about, so there's seven in total. And throughout this video, I'm going to be adding some footage of vlogs that Outlaw and I have done in these places, the first five places. There's no footage for the other two recommendations, because I've not been there, but as soon as we go there, we will upload that footage. Guys, I hope you enjoy. If you've been to these places, let me know what you thought about them in the comments. If you've got any other recommendations for St. Mary, also let me know in the comments as well. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Number one on my list is Strawberry in the Fields, located in Robins Bay, St. Mary. A uh, beautiful place. You do have to pay an admission fee to get in here. Guys, watch my video on this for more information. It's also close to Robins Bay Beach as well. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. If you've not been to Strawberry in the Fields, please take a visit just have a look at this footage absolutely beautiful Different things that happen in schemes and packaging. In our one night for shows, I'm juggling. Go like the ocean, my boat, I'm paddling. Shout out to my fella, that's my bro, my family. Frozen trades. When it comes to money, I take concentrate. Look at the illustrates, you are not my mate. If you become a shop, never be head of state. But my people then go say, I don't want to I don't want to die. I don't want to I want to enjoy. I want to life. I want to buy me I want to build house. I still want to know. All right, number two is Galena Lighthouse. Again, this is a really interesting place. It's steeped in history. Um, watch the video again on our channel. Um, this is not an all day um, visit. If you're passing Galena, I'd recommend that you veer off. It's not far from the main road. Drive down and have a look at this beautiful um, lighthouse that's still in working order. Yeah, so Galena Lighthouse, number two on the list. And admission is absolutely free. There is no cost to come down here to have a look. Drive down and take a look. You're talking the things that you say, where they make you feel alright. And I catch a vibe and it's time that I look in your face. Tell me why you look so fine. Baby girl, I see you. Wanna ride you like a bicycle. And you they blow my mind from a mile ago. And I don't go lie, you light up my life. And when she tell me my love is your love, baby. She don't want the Gucci, but I'm already Cause she give me butterflies in my belly. Oh, Lord. And when she tell me my love is your love, baby. And my word is right, and baby, she gon' save me. Cause she give me butterflies in my belly. Oh, Lord. Cause your love is crazy, girl, your love is crazy. You amaze me. Alright, number three on the list is Blue Hole. Now, this may shock a few people because. 
99.999% of people think that Blue Hole is in Ocherias. It's not in Ocherias, it's not even in St. Anne. It is, in fact, in St. Mary. The White River is St. Mary, right? But it is very close to the border. As you know, White River is the border between St. Mary and St. Anne. Blue Hole is in the parish of St. Mary. So even though it's always advertised Blue Hole Ochi, Blue Hole Ochi, you know that Ocherias is a tourist place, of course. Whatever, whatever you put Ochi is to, it's going to sell off, right? But it's in my parish, guys. It is in St. Mary. Blue Hole. Yeah, a very popular attraction. Very popular with locals. Very popular with tourists as well, this one. Excellent place to go and visit. There is an admission cost to go to Blue Hole. Please check out what that is before you go. I think it's about $20 or $25 per person. But check before you go. <laughs> If they like with the job, but they do my do, then no go catch up. Uh, oh, you're going to be a no. I so play my mouth. You go do you one time, my boy, for one time, I'm not to buy mess up. Anything you wish me, that be a passion. Mm, bad man, no, they walk up. Man, no, be God. Make them the talker. I should they fly like helicopter. Nobody girls have got an inshallah with them over. Question, but then no get the answer. 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 Alright, number four on the list is Spanish Bridge in St. Mary. Now, in order to get to Spanish Bridge, you actually have to drive in the same direction as Blue Hole. Anybody that's been to Blue Hole before knows this man that you're about to see now. The weed man, right? So he sells like um, brownies, you know, weed brownies and all that type of thing if you're into that. But, you know, you don't pass and not take a picture with him even if you are not going to buy anything. So, yes, the weed reggae brown, I think it's called reggae brownies. Reggae weed brownie guy, that's him. So you pass Blue Hole in order to get to Spanish Bridge. Again, it's in history. Spanish bridge but it's a, a place where especially locals love to come and jump off the bridge I'm not brave enough to jump off the bridge if you are this will be the perfect place for you right Spanish bridge This is another one of my favorites, Mad River, located in St. Mary, Sandy Hill. I love, 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 love it here. There is a very small admission fee, I think we're about $500. You know, uh, the locals keep the place clean. I tell you what though, the water was freezing cold, um, so I was reluctant. But once I got in and warmed up, I loved every minute of it. I really enjoyed going to Mad River, one of my favorite places to go in St. Mary. Yeah. 
Right now, I've got two other recommendations for places to go in St. Mary. One is Tapioca Getaway, and the other one is Castleton Botanical Gardens and River. This is on Injunction, so when you're driving through Injunction, that's where these are located. I've not been there, but I've heard great things about them. I can't wait to visit, and once I visit, of course, I'm gonna upload the video so that you can see what it's all about. If any of you guys have been to Tapioca Getaway or Castleton River Botanical Gardens, let me know, leave your comments. Was it good? What did you think of it? Guys, thanks for watching this Vlogmas, and we'll see you in the next video. Until next time, that was there.